Hey everyone, how's it going? Big LT here, Digital Spare Big LT Radio. Good Kobe. And welcome to a food review. Today, M&M's. Crunchy cookie flavor. I think this is an Easter thing, because I saw it on uh, Facebook that it's an Easter thing. Also, you probably hear a lot of noise going on outside because my window's open, just so I let you know that. It's nice out. Well, it's nice out, so that's why I had the window open. We, knew, we should know, we were outside doing something earlier today. Yes. You can open it now. It smells like chocolate. <laughs> is this just me or these? They look tinier than usual, is it? Is it just me? It's yeah. Yeah. a little bit tinier for some reason. I had hardly any metal in it. Let's try a different one. This one's a lot bigger. Hmm. I think these are supposed to be more like crispy M&Ms. Mm -hmm. just, just a smudge, right? It's a button. Yeah. I don't know if they still, I don't know if they're still calling it crispy M&Ms out there, if there is any. These ones just taste like just regular crispy M&Ms. Which is not to say that's a bad thing. No. That's your opinion. I used to love crispy M&Ms when I was a kid. Like, you don't? This isn't like crispy M&Ms when I was a kid. Oh. I used to love, I, when they first released, I loved the hell out of those crispy M&M's. Whenever, whenever I got per permission from like my grandma or something to get one, what I would do is, I'm getting the car, I get the, I get the M&M's, I put it in my mouth and I started sucking at it until I got to the crispy part. And I'd suck that until it was um, softened, so to speak. Mm. And then I would swallow it. I do that, I tend to do that with a lot of different candies too. Um, I think there's one other example I could think that I could think of, but I don't remember what it was called. So I think I did that with some chips too. As Skyboy Rules would say, no chips, fries. No, it's no fries, chips. No fries, chips. No Coke, Pepsi. Then he does the opposite. Cheeseburger, 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 cheeseburger. Cheeseburger. Cheeseburger! Cause that's what that's what they did in the skit. That's what they did in Saturday Night Live. They go, that one guy would say cheeseburger, he didn't listen. He's like, cheeseburger, cheeseburger, cheeseburger! And then he just keeps hitting him until he says, cheeseburger, cheeseburger, cheeseburger! What? Aka. What did I do? I don't know. No. <laughs> no, I was hoping you would do something else, actually. Uh... The other thing, after that. That you, that you and Scotty Boy Rules used to do whenever you hit each other. Like that. Think real hard, it was a Nickelodeon thing. You can do it to me. What was that for? Okay. I don't remember that. What was that for? For eating my calzone. Okay. Skyway rules. What was that for? For an idiot. Okay. When you do it to you, you'd be like, oh. What was that for? <laughs> for going out. Okay. For going to Walmart without me. Okay. But most of the time it was just for being an idiot. Okay. True. That also reminds me, like, um, I would play Monopoly Streets, and there's this one line that, <laughs> that when I first heard it, I busted out laughing. And I know it's supposed to be a food review, but let me talk about this. So, there is a line in, in Monopoly Streets for, like, Xbox 360 and um, PS3, and I'm not sure if it's on the Wii, though, but when you land on the go-to-jail space, there is a chance when Mr. Monopoly comes in and... and Tells you what you're under arrest for, he'll, he might say this. He might go, You are under arrest for your own protection. <laughs> <laughs> I buzzed out laughing from that one. But there's a, there's some really there's some like it like understandable ones, like you're under arrest for jaywalking or um 
outstanding parking tickets. And it's like, okay, that makes sense. But the one that always gets me is the, your own protection. And it's like, okay. <laughs> somebody out to get me? What the hell? And what do I have to go to jail for? Anyway, uh, what do you think? Mm. You know, all yours up already? Oh. You're still so Okay, I've only been, I only made a scratch in it, but that's okay. I'll I'd say about maybe a five. Five? Mmm, 7.5 for me. Just because it's crispy m ms and I can't give crispy m ms a bad review, but otherwise I, I was expecting maybe more of a cookie flavor. A little bit. Oh, just a little bit. Skyboy Rules, if you're watching this, LT here has some information for you that I just realized today. I'll bring it up to him, don't worry. I feel ashamed. <laughs> you might you might just mess me and see after this when the video goes up. He's like, what is he ashamed of? And I'll tell him. And he's like, really? Uh, you know what I'll just say right now? He didn't realize Scotty Boy Rules actually had a lazy eye until today. That's true. Yeah. I didn't. And, like, he, and, you, and he's known Steady Boy Rules for like 10 plus years right about now. By now. Yeah. Yeah. Because you and I met in 2011. Because mm. I remember Hard Golds of Silver came out in 2010, and 2011 is when Black and White actually, came out. Actually, I know you actually a little bit longer than him. Yeah, but I'm just saying it was 2012. You you guys met in 2012. This is 2022. Yes. Well, of course, it'll be 10 years by, I guess, summer, because it feels like it was summertime when that happened. But Or who knows? Maybe it is 10 years, and maybe come summer it'll be 11. But regardless, yeah, you know me longer because I was the one that you met first, and then I was the one that dragged you to Skype by Rules' place one day when we were in the area. Yep. All because another friend of mine introduced me to him. So, But that was before I moved here. So, but anyway, ready to wrap it up? All right. So, thank you all so much for watching this episode of the Food Reviews. I actually have something a little bit special for you guys uh, later this week, because considering I'm supposed to do these on Friday, I know this is Sunday, but I forgot. And he was here on Friday, and we were going to do this, but we forgot. And he's here now. We're making up for it, so hope it makes up for it. And I won't share what it is on Friday, but look forward to it. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I'm a big LT. Think about me. I'll see you guys next time. Take care.